Utah toddler is one of the first in the country to receive a potentially groundbreaking therapy. And his dad is doing everything he knows how to give his son the strength to win his fight. Here's new specialist Heather Simonson with one family's remarkable story. Look, there's your cows. Deep in farm country of central Utah, a family is counting their blessings. I would call it living the dream. Yes, ma'am. Four years ago, while riding in the high country, Alex White and his horse went off a cliff. The fall shattered Alex's foot. Far from help. I thought, man, I'll never get out of here. And Alex climbed back on that horse and rode for 20 miles. You know, if I would have quit, I would have never made it out. <laughs> never was that toughness more vital than when his wife... I was pretty torn up. ...gave birth to their son, Cinch. I cried a lot. Not gonna lie. Newborn screening showed Cinch has spinal muscular atrophy, or SMA. I was working at the sawmill, and I just... I didn't even tell anybody I was leaving. I just put my machine away and left. The neuromuscular disorder paralyzes a baby in the first few weeks or months of life. Well, my first thought was my son will never be able to ride broncs or rope or just be a cowboy in general. Many babies with SMA don't survive to their second birthday. But the day after Cinch was born, the FDA approved a new therapy. Felt like our prayers were were definitely answered. In a single infusion, a virus delivers a new copy of the gene into the baby's nerves. Only this time it's not delivering a disease gene that, caught that, that just causes more virus to be made, but a gene that we care about. It's a $2.1 million treatment. I was thinking, man, there's no way I'll ever pay for it. But Alex was determined. We just stayed on top of it. I wasn't I wasn't going to be the one to not get it. And with the help from insurance and Primary Children's Hospital, Cinch... He's got attitude like me. <laughs> ...got it. But the Whites wouldn't know for months if it worked. Still, every day's a waiting game, and we just have... We have no idea. So Alex wrote a book to teach kids they can do hard things, even when they're hurt or discouraged. Early one morning, a cowboy stepped out of his camp into the corral. And held his breath the day Cinch took his first steps. <laughs> Come here. He just cruises. It just brings a tear to your eye. Finally, they made it back to the corral. Time will tell yeah. if the gene replacement therapy is indeed a breakthrough. I just hope he never quits. <laughs> but with love that's wider than a prairie... I guess on a scale of 1 to 10, I'd call it a 12. ...and the wonders of medical science... <laughs> oh, good job. Cinch has a shot at a bright future full of promise. Yeah, those are yours. Heather Simonson, KSL 5 News. Thank you, Heather, and go cinch. Treating spinal muscular atrophy early is critical, and two years ago, Utah was the first state to be screening newborns for this condition. Yeah, we wish that young cowboy the I best know, of luck. I know, yeah.